Hey, what's up everyone? James Hurst with The Marketing Show. And in today's video, I'm gonna talk about at least five different support channels that High Level has in place for you to get where you're trying to go, okay? So there's, you know, there's the support chat, right? There's the Facebook group. There's the ideas board. There is the, the phone number. There's the live Zoom room, okay? Let's talk about each one of these to, so you can know which one you need to use depending on what's going on with your situation, okay? So uh, let's talk about the support chat, okay? So this is the question mark here in the upper right hand corner. You have this live chat. OK. Um, most of the time what I use this for is if I'm trying to report a bug. OK, so um, if you think that you have a bug, you could you could use the Facebook group to kind of, hey, does anyone else experiencing this? Oh, yeah, me too, me too, me too. Right. So you kind of know, OK, this is a bug. It's not just me. It's not just my cookies, my my cache, my browser. Um, so. If you think you have a bug, then do your very best to like sh create a loom video and uh, and grab the location ID, right? So there's the location ID up in the top and uh, give uh, the developers as much uh, information as you can on how to reproduce this bug that you that you think that you found, okay? Um, you know, live Zoom support is not gonna be able to help you uh, fix that right there. Um, they're not gonna be able to create a ticket even for you, okay? So you really have to come to the support chat um, over here and just create a new ticket, um, fill out this thing, possibly wait for a little while. And that's your best way to get a ticket created with, with the development team. Okay. Um, now what if you're like me and you're always like, um, wow, I think it would be really cool if, if such and such had images, you know, if, if, uh, calendars, you know, if calendars had images, right? Like, Let's see if I have one here. Yes, right here, okay. Hey, it looks like there's this perfect spot for um, images on calendars, right? We should all rally behind this idea and like, hey, if everyone like blows up this thread, I'm sure they'll do it, right? Well, no, uh, that's the ideas board. And so that is right here. It's ideas.gohighlevel.com. And what you're gonna do is you're going to pick the thing. So calendars, right? You're going to search and see maybe other people have already created that same great idea. So images and calendars, add image element option to calendars. Look at that, 14 votes. So this is the actual one, right? So here's my thing. I made my little ideas board post. And then I take this link uh, and take it back to my personal post. I can make a YouTube video, drive people to um, that, that URL, that link. I could uh, try to get votes for it like you see I've done right here, okay? So that's feature requests, enhancements, new cool things, right? All the stuff, all the bells and whistles that we all love and how fast they get them to us. The ideas board is what you use for that, okay? Okay, so we've talked about the support chat, right? We've talked about the ideas board. What about the live Zoom room? Did you know they have a live Zoom room, okay? So let's talk about that. When would you use that? So first of all, it's only Monday through Friday seven to seven CST and Saturdays, nine to five. So if, are you within those hours? That would be one thing I would ask myself, right? And then you would just come in here. Uh, it's speak with us slash success. You would give your name, your email. Are you an existing client? And then you're going to also need to provide your, um, your relationship number, okay? And you can see there's a little video right here. So you go to company tab, right? So you go up here agency view and then it goes to settings company tab relationship number right there okay so let's do that let's go get our relationship number hit next and right here is where you're going to put your relationship number and then say i need a q a okay you would sit there the, the trouble with this one is sometimes you get in quickly other times you just don't it's like it could be a little bit of a wait as well any of these could could have a wait um, now, obviously the, uh, the Facebook group is more instantaneous and there's a lot of helpful people there. Um, but it may not be the right place for the thing that you're trying to do, which is why I'm making this video. Okay. So yeah, you have your support chat, which I think for bugs, or if you like, if you kind of like the chat, if you don't want to zoom with someone, you just want to chat. Uh, if you can get it fixed right then and there on the call, like that's great, right? You can ask questions there. You can also do billing support here as well. Just any kind of question, right? You might be able to get it solved over chat. Um, 
for me, I use it as a place to get a ticket started usually for development, right? I think there's a bug. I think there's something here. Here's the loom of what's happening. Can you create a ticket? If it's, if it's a big time bug, then um, like if you think this is impacting a lot of people, then go ahead and get that ticket and maybe even post it in, in the group. I'm sure Sean wouldn't mind if, if he got tagged on something that was really had a high impact on a lot of people. Get, get them that ticket number and then he can escalate it to engineering and get that, uh, get that worked on as soon as possible. So we've got the support chat. We've got the live Zoom room, right? We've got the ideas board. Now we come to the Facebook the Facebook group where I, where I spend a fair amount of time, right? So here I'm using the ideas board, right? Cause I want more flexibility on the uh, appointment slots. Uh, this is good for like, I don't know, like more like strategy, like, Hey, how would you guys, you know, how would you, how would you go about such and such, right? How would you go about doing this? Hey, can anyone help me with this? I'm looking for that. I think we kind of know, um, it's like asking kind of questions a little bit outside the tool. Hopefully this could be like the catch all after these, all these other options are, um, are used up, exhausted, right? So um, hopefully that helps point you in the right direction on where you need to go to get your support. The last one that I didn't mention actually was th there's a phone number, right? So if I come here, uh, let's see if I actually put it right here. So I keep a little shortcut here. It's 1-888-732-4197. You can also get maybe some billing support that way. It is a phone number. I don't use that a ton. I use the other options, but yeah, uh, there is the support phone number. Don't quote me on the hours, but it might be, I might be 24 seven. I don't, I don't know for sure. Um, and then I guess there's also this, you could, um, you could potentially upgrade to priority support. So if you're a heavy user of this thing, oh yeah, call high level support right there. 24 seven support right there. If you're a heavy user, I haven't done this priority support yet. Up click to upgrade, uh, going to be an additional charge and be that much faster that you get help. Uh, and then like, let's just put this out there. The last, the last option you could maybe send me a DM, but I'm still going to like put in you know, prioritize, you know, what I've got going on. Um, but let's make sure that we've exhausted all the different support channels first and then go from there. So, Thanks so much, guys. Hope you're doing well. We'll see you in the next video. Bye. Hope you enjoyed the show. Advice given is for educational purposes only and may not be applicable to your business. You should know that the marketing show receives compensation through its affiliate relationship for the products and services it recommends. Thank you for your support, and we hope to see you on the next episode of The Marketing Show.